so the Pelexi River is pretty much gone dry, this drought. Um, what's cool is about our river is what you'll find in the river. Just sweep a little bit of the dirt and dust away. This is what you'll find. Dinosaur tracks. I'll see the claw marks. Good size. Theropod. Again. Awesome, awesome traps. And these are normally underwater, so you don't usually get to see these. Uh, the traps that most people are excited about, they've seen the video or the pictures of the three toed tracks. Um, they, they look a lot like a Tyrannosaurus Rex track, but this animal lived um, uh, almost as far behind Tyrannosaurus Rex as Tyrannosaurus Rex is behind us in time. Um, so it's an animal, it's a dinosaur called Acrocanthosaurus from 113 million years ago. Um, it was a bipedal, you know, two legged carnivore. Um, small arms, very much like a Tyrannosaurus Rex, but a little bit smaller. Uh, but it was still a pretty large, a large creature. They, they, they were about seven tons or so when they were big. Uh, so not a small, it's not a small critter for sure. There's tons of So it's kind of a double-edged sword because without the river, we wouldn't be able to see them. We wouldn't know they were there. But once they're exposed, that's when they start to degrade. Just like any other rock, they're going to break down over time thanks to weathering and erosion. 